Yeah, it was brought up in the interview, the audio. I don't think I got shot once. I, I, I fucked them bitches up. I was like... You know? Snake, you're already in the sewers? Eva, yeah, I just got down here. Mm. I'm coming to meet you now. The door at the north end is open, right? Uh, Snake? Let me guess. There's a problem. Yeah. What is it this time? The colonel found out you escaped. He did, huh? Figured as much. Wonder why. Yeah, and now all of Grozny Grad is on red alert. Just my luck. But once I'm out of the fortress, you can't get out. I can't. No. Yeah. When the fortress went on red alert, they sealed off the sewers. You've got to be kidding me. <laughs> I'm serious, and that means the escape route I laid out is it's sealed off too. Right. And they just sent a unit out looking for you. Down here. Uh huh. They'll be there any minute now. You've got to get out quick. But isn't the exit sealed off? You should be able to get out by heading straight north. Book it, Snake. If they find you, you're dead. Why is why you gotta have the conversation then, lady? Give me that shit. Look at this, dudes. Look at this. Ocelot. Huh? Pretty fun. Bitch item. Woo, shit. The future of gaming looking good? Hell yeah. Unless you're American, y'all be getting uh, rumors about, about your fucking import taxes going up 25% to screw China or some shit. <laughs> y'all gonna be paying $600 for the PlayStation 5. Man, I should start a podcast. I've been thinking about starting at least not not a weekly or anything like that. But every time, I, you know, I want to talk about something for a few hours. Put on the microphone. Like, what's the difference between a podcast and like a really long vlog? Other than having a couple of set topics. I don't know what I'm doing, man. I'm just, I'm just living life. Just jumping around the sewers. Hey, this is the second Metal Gear game that has sewers. Is it? Is it the second? We have... We have uh, Metal Gear Solid 3. And we have Metal Gear Rising. Shut up! Dork. Look at my leg. I got shot in the fucking leg. And no one cares. You need to look into some headphones for PlayStation 5? Yeah, it really does. I, I feel, you know, PlayStation 5... I feel like I, I'm... Look at this little bitch! PlayStation 5, I feel like people are gonna be rebuying a bunch of shit, you know? New monitors. Hey, you give me that ass. Oh. Monitors and... Headphones and speakers. It seems like it's going to be a real upgrade. But with backwards compatibility, maybe you all just start to sell your, uh... I don't got a backpack, so I think eat it here. It's time to sell your PlayStation 4, so you don't have to keep the PS4. I do hope the backwards compatibility extends to the PlayStation 1, 2, and 3 also. Look at this sexy ass garden. Garden. Sewer. Not much of a difference. Look at that. See the color they went with? Stylized over realism. It's not gray. It's not ganky and danky. No, it's just fucking pretty. I love the detail. Oh, look at the dog. Huh? That came right back at me. Ah! Ugh! Eat shit! Run!
Run, snake. Dude, I got shot in the leg. And I'm out running two dogs. I didn't kill my wife. I'm gay. Enter Ocelot. <laughs> Does someone say gay around here? I've been waiting for this. Nobody interfere. This is how this is how Tommy Lee Jones should have done the scene. That's like really flamboyant. <laughs> that's the that's the bullet that jammed at the beginning of the game. Out of his original gun. This is where it ends. <laughs> Jesus pose That's a broken ass neck dude You're dead Every one of your officers there think you're a dipshit, dude. Don't die on me yet. Every single guy behind you thinks you're a fucking moron. Look at them, they're looking at him. They won't say it because they don't want to get fucked up. They're looking at them, they're like, you dumb bitch. Fucking idiot. <laughs> Oh shit, we're in Australia. Or California four months ago. When was that? That was fucked up. Power line. California girls. Yeah. I am the sorrow. Like you, I too am filled with sadness. This world is one of sadness. Battle brings death. Death brings sorrow. The living. I feel like he's reading out my friend's Facebook posts. Oh shit. Hopefully this goes well. So, this is the reason why I haven't been... Um, I haven't been killing people a lot. The more people you kill, the longer this shit goes. This, this thing will go for days. 
But what you are able to do, if you want, you're able to drown yourself. Watch this shit. You're not able to swim. Why? You see, sit back up. Look at that guy. How creepy is that? I'm gonna die. I don't got any help. There's the flame dudes I set on fire earlier. That's the guy running from bees, I guess. I guess I killed him somehow. I'm gonna die. I'm not gonna be able to beat this. I got no health. But this motherfucker shoots shit at you. Damn, I fucked your ass up. You're gonna be seeing a lot of cutthroats around here. Good times. I, I think these are all the guys on the mountain I was shooting when I loaded the game up today. <laughs> Oh, damn. Just let me zigzag a little bit. Hey, to be fair, all these motherfuckers came at me. All right? They came at me. Oh! Ah! I could really deal with some health. I'm in trouble. If you keep getting hit by that, you see solid snake. At the end, on like I think on the fourth, on the fourth attack, you see snake. Woo! Fuck you, pain, dick, dick. And if you want to give up, click the revival pill. But if you make it to the end of all this. You get his uniform. So this is like fighting the other bosses in their, uh, in their trank only mode. Back again. Yeah. I think I beat this boss fight. Uh, I died. I, I got to the end of this boss fight back in the day twice. And didn't realize you had to use the revival pill. And restart it. Had no idea what was going on. I think... If you call somebody, you get some weird shit going down. Snake, wake up. Open your eyes. Snake, you have to get up. Snake! Snake! Eva. Snake, what's wrong? Snake! Eva's boobies. Snake! She's 28 years old. Snake, don't quit on me now. Snake! Snake! 24? 24? How, how old is paramedic? Snake, answer me! Snake! 28. Hold up. What was zero? Snake, wake up. Open your eyes. 55. Alright. So, uh, there's one person. Damn it! In my codex that I'm, I'm actually younger than now. I'm fucked, man. I'm not going to be able to beat this. I'm dead, man. I, I'm not going to... I can't get through all this with this health. <laughs> I did that. That was fun. Okay, one of you is trying too hard to be scary. Calm down. You gotta watch out for skulls in the in the water also. They eat the shit out of your balls. I'm not gonna be able to get my uniform. I'm gonna have to quit. I got no help. Can I stay around here for a bit? I'm not using the life med. Fuck that. Gotta be something I can do. Instant noodle that ass. I'm not gonna walk forward. I'm gonna walk around here. I'm gonna stay around here for a minute. Hopefully men don't show up. He's probably gonna shoot at me. But I don't care. I'll zigzag. As long as 
as long as zombies as long as the, the ghosts don't walk down here man you suck no no stay over there stay over there shit oh I can shoot them with my gun too that didn't work out Damn it. My health went up. They, they gave me easy mode. All right, I'll take that. I don't give a fuck. Hell yeah. I'll take that shit. I was thinking about just giving it in. Fair, all right. Well, that's not happening. My son's sons. Was that a potential storyline they were they're working on? You know, you're thinking up, but then decided that they shouldn't go with it. Out of my way. Y'all look the same. I can't remember any of your names, man. I'm sorry. At least Johnny's not here. Fuck off! Can I dive underwater to dodge it? Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, you can shoot the ghost to make them, like, disappear for a second, so you can get some free time. Hey. The pain. Hey, they killed themselves. Ah! Let's not forget that. They killed themselves. Uh, I, I beat everyone with trank guns. Progress. Somewhere new. Yeah, I didn't kill that many people, right? <laughs> Woo! He went for my ankles! Hey! Ocelot unit! Did I kill you guys? Damn! Lots of cut throats in this playthrough! Unless that's meant to be a bullet. Oh, that one's definitely meant to be a bullet. <laughs> I killed several of you guys too? Damn it. And this was me holding back. <laughs> My friends and I We used to we used to have uh, fun uh, with this game because we used to play it so much. Oh in the nuts! I shot him in the nuts! And one of the things we used to do is see how many men we could kill in a single playthrough. So we get spotted on purpose and just keep killing over and over again. And I think the highest, what, I don't know if it was me or him, but we got to like 978 or something. Murders. In a, in a, in a, in a playthrough. The fear. The fear. Your outfit sucks, dude. Oh shit. Okay, I narrowly avoided that skull. I could hear it, but I couldn't see it. So it was too late. Where you going, man? Nice, there's not many people here now. Hey, dude! Hey, Rykov! That's actually why I killed him. That's why I went back and murdered his ass. So he'd appear here. <laughs> Got a duck! 
No. I was trying. Didn't let me. Woo! Fucking skulls. We still have to pass the fury. This is such a cruel bitch. Oh, the end? Just the end now? I let the bird survive though. Thank you. Oh, the scientists. Hey, you guys ratted me out so many times. That's not my problem, alright? Fuck you. Fuck you. Why, you looking for revenge? Is that the idea here? Okay, I remember him. And I remember that bird too. I actually didn't eat that bird, I had to throw it away. My bad. Nice! Bad touch! Damn it! Spoilers! I'm gonna die. I ain't beating it. There's gonna be a fucking... That's fun. Missed. Please, no more. I haven't killed... Damn! I haven't killed anybody. After the fury. Have I? I didn't kill anybody. Nice. Ah, oh, lovely. I'm trying, man. I'm trying. Remember that body earlier on in the game when we fell off the bridge after, well, the boss threw us off the bridge and I was healing myself? That's the sorrow there. That's his, uh... That's his body we came across earlier in the game. Woo! Shit, we did it. Now, once you make it to the end and die, that's when you can use the revival pill to get the item. But if you want, you can make this boss fight like two seconds long. Jesus, dude. Boss, you have to shoot me. I can't. Shoot me. You want to finish your mission, don't you? Then, you'll have to shoot me. <sighs> the spirit of the warrior will always be with you. Don't be sad. We'll meet again someday. Did she shoot him in the eye? Sorrow was the boss's husband. The guy we just... The ghost guy that was just talking. And he apparently sounds like Michael's dad in chat. <laughs> we alright? Well, there's no fire at least. No ghosts. Damn! I'm calling a taxi and going home. Snake, are you alright? That was a close call. What the hell happened to me? You were halfway drowned at the bottom of the river. Almost crossed over to the other side. Other side? So that really was... Something on your mind, Snake? Major, was there a man in the Cobra unit called the Sorrow? 
Yeah, I've heard of him. He was an uncanny soldier who fought alongside the boss. What kind of man was he? The Sorrow was a man with, well, special powers. He had ESP, which was the subject of extensive research in the Soviet Union at the time. He was especially gifted as a medium. A medium? Someone who can communicate with the spirit world and evoke the spirits of the dead. In other words, he could talk to ghosts. They say he could find out what was going on in a battle by talking to dead soldiers. What about him and the boss? What was the story between them? I don't know the details. Why don't we ask Sigurd? Yo! Yo. <laughs> I finished checking up on this Sorrow guy a while ago. Thought you guys already knew, though. Knew what? That he's dead. He's been dead for two years now. Died two years ago? At Salino Yards. You know, those cliffs you were at. And the boss is the one who did him in. The boss? Yep. Two years ago, the boss was sent by the CIA on a secret mission to Salino Yards. That's when she met the Sorrow, who'd gone back to the Soviet Union after the Cobras broke up at the end of the war. Except this time, they were enemies. And then what? The boss killed the Sorrow herself and accomplished her mission. At least, that's what the records say. So, he was never there in the first place. He just couldn't let go of the boss. You okay, Snake? Yeah, I'm fine. It looks like it's not time for me to die yet. I sure hope not. Otherwise, the whole mission is shot. We're counting on you, pal. Roger that. Eva? Snake, you didn't call. I was worried. Are you all right? Needy. Yeah. I took a pretty freaky detour. What are you talking about? Nothing. Forget it. Let's just say I'm back. Good. But how did you escape from the sewers? I jumped into the river. From all the way up there? You're out of control. Yeah. I got carried away by the current and almost drowned. Great. That's perfect. What do you mean, that's <laughs> perfect? I mean, if you ended up in the river, then I know a good spot nearby. Let's meet up there. Where is it? Keep going upstream until you get to a waterfall. A waterfall, huh? Right. Behind that waterfall, there's a cave. We'll meet in there. The cave behind the waterfall upstream. Got it. See you there. Nice. Let's do this. So, he saw dead people. I don't like you. And I still don't got a backpack. All I got is a bunch of shitty jokes. Oh, fuck! I got poisoned! Alright. See what happens when you read chat? Um, what now? Uh, I used them all. Wait, hold up. Time out. Something happened to me. I'm dying over here. The hell? I'm di I'm dying. The fuck is this? What's 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 the uh the the vocal support gotta say? The waterfall where it God, you're worthless. Paramedic. It sounds like you've got food yeah. poisoning. Food poisoning is caused by eating poisonous food. When you have food poisoning, your life will continuously decrease. If left untreated, you'll eventually throw up whatever it was you ate. That'll get rid of the food poisoning, but you'll also use up a lot of stamina. So it's a good idea to treat it yourself before you vomit. To cure food poisoning, go into Cure in the Survival Viewer and take some antidote. But I did that! I did- I'm gonna die! Antidote! I got 14 out of 15! This never happened before, man. I'm gonna die of food poisoning. Right? Alright. Well, now that the sorrow section's over, I can kill anybody I want and not have to worry- Ooh, my friend! About anything else ever again. Where's the little bitch that caught me? 
Am I poisoned? God, I'm dumb. It's all good. It was a glitch in the game. I fixed it. You know how these HD remasters are. Ocelot unit, huh? Damn it. It's all good. Damn. Give me that shit. Nobody. Where are you at, man? I got five bullets. How many y'all are there? Huh? I used to hide under there. But I don't think I need to this time. <laughs> oh shit, I didn't even know where that guy was. All right. Fuck this. <laughs> Bitch ass. Right. Now, I'm in control. I got I got distracted by the the food poisoning. Nothing's gonna hold me back this time from kicking ass. Turn around, bitch. I got this. Don't worry about it. That was a drowning sound, too. I drowned. Alright. Hold on. Yeah! Yeah! Laugh now, bitch! Laugh now! Yeah, shit. Hold up. You hear the beepy beeps? From the transmitter? Is that a dude? Or is that a, a mountain? There we go. Stay still, dickhead. Oh, it bounced back! Damn, He's that was here. sexy. Who's that? Nobody. Come here. Hey. Wanna come around this way? You bitch! That's the second time you moved at the, at the last second.
Yeah! Yeah! Damn, look at this. Maybe I can get a headshot from here. Nothing around. I love this game. Bollocks. Luckily, I'm a stealth master. Yeah! <laughs> it's so satisfying. Damn it. Man, you're ratting me out. I believe it's only me and you left. What? <laughs> There we go. I still got it. Now, let's go for a swim. I think there's shit down here. Not yet. All right. Nice. Look at these little bitches. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, we did good. <laughs> oh, snapped all my fingers. This game is fantastic. If you've never played Metal Gear Solid, you're missing out. I mean, look how good looking that bitch is. He got his face kicked in and everything, and his nose still looks good. Think they'll announce Splinter Cell at E3? Yes. Splinter Cell 2019 announced at E3. You heard it here first. Woo shit! You're fucking up your bike, girl. Nice to meet you, Snake. I'm Tatiana. Here's your equipment. Eva, you could use a towel. So could you. I could use an eye. Anybody got a fucking eye? I lost it because of you and you're making jokes. All right. Ten hours. Ten hours. When was this? This is like two hours ago. Eleven hours fifty-two, dude. That was two hours ago. No way. Didn't we save it when we got tortured? An hour ago. Makes sense, I guess. She has no ass. Want some? No thanks. No. Shh. Thank you. <laughs> Don't like snakes. Not for dinner. 
All right. Didn't you have to eat them at the KGB? In my training, we always got the good stuff. French, Italian, that kind of thing. A regular Matahari. The least you could do is call me Cynthia. Tell me something. How does it feel to spy on your own country? I can't say it feels good, but it's my job. Can't even eat a snake during a mission, huh? I wouldn't mind eating you. Some professionalism, please! <laughs> when this mission's over, you'll have to treat me to a nice dinner. What do you want to eat? Let's see. How about sushi? Sushi? It's Japanese. I hear it's all the rage right now. Supposedly, it's made from raw fish. Her lips are more raw chapped fish. than snakes. Just the place for my survival techniques. Thank you, Snake. What a thrill. I'll be your eyes from now on. I'm searching and I'm melting to you. <laughs> what a fear in my heart. But you're so supreme. Thank you. Are you all right? It's not like I can't see. I've got one good eye and can still fire a gun. Really? Good. The butterflies singing to them. Remember the last joke you made? Snake. Come here for a minute. There's something in here. When did it get like that? Hold still. Let me do it. <laughs> you know, I've been trained to do this kind of thing myself. Just relax and let me handle it. Oh, Chris Jericho! I can't believe how small it is. Yeah, but it gets the job done. <laughs> really? Here, lift up your hips. <laughs> like this? Yeah. How's that? You're pretty good at that. Yeah, everybody tells me that. <laughs> Hold steady, I'm not done yet. <laughs> there, a transmitter. <laughs> how they do it in the KGB? Sometimes. Would you rather I did it American style? <laughs> but how'd you know there was a transmitter lodged there? That's some female intuition you've got. But she was in the room when Ocelot did it. She was standing right behind him. Damn, look at my sexy new eye patch. You can fuck that hole. Uh, didn't you steal some explosives out of the fortress? C3, a highly potent explosive from the west. It can be molded into any shape, like clay. With just this much, you could blow up the Shagohat and the lab along with it. Is that right? Yeah, but there's a trick to using it. Tell me about it. <laughs> she got the bigger hat. Well, what do you think? I don't even know her last name, man. She all over me. The Shagohad's booster unit uses liquid fuel. The fuel tanks are in the main wing of the weapons lab in the hangar housing the Shagohad itself. So I should blow up the tanks. That's the basic idea. 
It should be enough to blow up the entire hangar. There are four fuel tanks. In order to destroy the hangar, you'll have to set explosives on each of those tanks. All four of them? It should be no sweat for you. Besides, the scientists had the day off today. So the hangar's completely deserted. Not quite. They've still got guards posted there. So what do I do after I set the C3? The bombs run off a timer. Once the timer has been set, the countdown will begin. When the timer reaches zero, the bombs will all go off at once. How long do I have? 20 minutes. Once the phase two trials are finished, I wouldn't be surprised if they kill all the scientists to prevent them from talking. So you've got to act fast. I'll take care of it. All right. Sounds like a plan. Eva, did you get the data on the Shagahod from Sokolov? Yeah. That's the mission I was given. By Khrushchev? Mm-hmm. America doesn't have any use for it, does it? Huh. But I haven't forgotten my other mission either. Helping you out. <laughs> Follow this cave and go up the ladder at the end. You'll come out inside Groznygrad, just southwest of the weapons lab. I do like my deep, dark tunnels. Do you remember when you went to rescue Sokolov? Remember there was a locked door when you entered the main wing from the second floor of the east wing? Yeah. That's the entrance to the Shagohad's hangar. Well, what is locked this time too? Use this key to open that door. Ah. Oh. The door right when I entered the main wing. Got it. What about you? I'll get things ready for our escape. There's a rail bridge to the north. I'm gonna set a bomb there, so I'm taking half of the C3 with me. Right. I'll set off the weapons lab then. Try not to be in the neighborhood when it happens. Gotcha. And watch out for Ocelot. He suspects you're not who you say you are. Don't worry. The Colonel still trusts me. And I have my ways. There's not a man alive who can resist my charms. Uh, Besides you, of course. I'm just warning you, Eva. That's all. I know. Okay, let's go. You seem like you were born on one of those. <laughs> if I didn't ride every day, I couldn't go on living. Huh? When I'm riding, the wind hits me so hard that it hurts. That pain keeps my mind off the pain of having to be someone else. It's not easy always fooling myself like this. It's only when I'm on the bike that I'm free to be the real me. I only get off my bike when I fall in love or fall dead. What's your name? Tatiana. No. Your real name. <laughs> What's wrong with Tanya? Huh. Okay, Tanya. Don't let anyone see you. Huh. Oh, this? It's a button camera. I don't remember this. What did you do that for? Insurance. To make sure you don't double cross me. Whoa. <laughs> Did I see the new frostbite engine and the uh, the hair physics? I was actually gonna mention the hair physics a second ago because Eva in this game is a blonde with really nice hair for PS2 era and then Eva in Devil May Cry 1 is a blonde with a plank of wood for hair. So it, it kind of just popped into my head. Hey, if you come back and you go all the way down here. Ah. Finally. Now, I didn't actually check there a minute ago. So maybe it was here all along. But either way, it's there now. Also, for those that uh, remember what I was talking about a while back. I mentioned... Oh, like, now there's snakes and everything. I mentioned that there was a special snake you can get for infinite ammo 
uh, with the mouse trap back in the back in the military base when I was jumping through the electric wire fences and stuff. Well, when we get captured, that special snake gets loose and it's here. So if you come back here and you recapture it and carry it to the end of the game alive, then you get infinite ammo. So just just keep that in mind if you're going after the infinite ammo in this game. Hey, y'all want to hear a funny joke though? Because everyone's been making a lot of funny jokes in the chat in the last hour that no one's laughed at. Well, here, here's my one. I'm leaving it here for today. That's the end of it. I hope y'all enjoyed it. <laughs> I have to. I have to because the next session, I'm not going to be able to beat it all tonight. That'd be, that's like another four hours of cutscenes and shit, including dying to bosses. So if I played it for another two hours, that means the next stream for Metal Gear Solid 3 is going to be like an hour long. Where if, the, if I cut it off here, then the next stream is going to be another four hours long. You got to time that shit, man. And mostly I just don't want to look at all your ugly names in the chat anymore. But, but I hope everyone's had a great day. I've had a great day. I kind of want to play Resident Evil 3. But I really want to eat food. So. Snake, do you know the creature from the Black Lagoon? Yep. Nope, never heard of it. These scientists are investigating a place deep in the Amazon called the Black Lagoon. And they get picked off one after the other by this fishman thing. And there was the scene when the heroine is going for a swim and the creature sneaks up on her from underwater. Oh, I thought my heart was going to stop. I mean, of course, the 3D effects and it came from outer space were a lot more intense, but... It wouldn't be referring to you coming from outer space, would it? How rude! Why do you say that? Because no one on Earth could be as charming as you. <sighs> Fine. I'll just get to the point, Snake. Be careful of what's around you when you're in the water. Just imagining you swimming in those jungle rivers makes me think of you being attacked by a fish man. I appreciate the concern. Fishmen aren't the only things that'll attack you in the water. Really be careful out there. Okay. And don't be attacking any pretty girls going for a swim, either. Are you calling me a fish man? You started it. I called you charming, bitch. <laughs> Take care of that flaky face. Yeah, dude, he's all falling apart. It's all falling apart right now. Fucking used moisturizer there the other night all over. I was going to do it before this stream too. So, you know, if, if I look like I'm sweating in future streams, moisturizer all over. I don't know what's gone wrong. My face got fucked up like a year ago. It's all dried up. Fucking decrepit and shit. I got holes in my face. Like uh, like 60 or 30 fucking little tiny holes in, in both sides of my face. Just dot 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 dot. And my friend said she, she was all like, she's all like makeup-y and stuff. She was all like, oh, you have fucked up pores. Here's what you gotta do. And I'm like, wait, what the fuck happened to do that in the first place? What's this shit about? You know, the rest of me is good. Look at, look at that smooth. Smooth. No calloused hands. Look at that. I got, I got a lump on my fucking knuckle though. Right, right there from art, I think. It's, it's the only, it's the only finger that has a lump on it. You see the dent? But, other than that, I'm, I'm good to go. But my face is falling off. You know, I'm like the mummy. Brendan Fraser. You know what I mean? But that's all I'm going to play for today of Metal 